Hey world. I have some days off. It feels so good to have time. Sit and enjoy the moment. To have the time to look out of the window and see the trees, how the colors are changing. Winter is coming. My life is becoming more and more busy. I am uh, actually um, planning something, planning my future. Um, not only pla planning, the planning phase uh, is going on, but um, <clears throat> changing, you know, my, my direction my my professional um, direction and I'm still working full time and I sometimes you know like am not satisfied how a little time I have to do the stuff that I want to do and so many things get lost I am writing less you know now that I have um, some days off and um, um, I continue to write on my on my process on my dip pro process I see how um, I'm actually creating a layer of resistance that you know is justified by the lack of time and it is such a thin thin layer but it doesn't matter there you know small things if if it's big or small it doesn't matter and you know, it's quite easy to, to push through that resistance. But I also see how I can get used to it so easily to in my daily busy life tell myself that I have, you know, I have no time. And Again, there's no big or small. I can take 10 minutes, 15 minutes to keep on writing. One point, one forgiveness statement in the written and Yes, process became part of my daily self-application. But there is a difference in writing, having taking the time to write it actually out. Have it on paper or on the computer screen in black and white. 
this makes such a big difference because um, when I work my process verbally in daily life, which um, is, um, it is, um, it has its place, it's, it's important to um, live the process and, and the daily motions. But the value I see in writing is that I can revisit it. I can really re revisit what I wrote uh, three weeks ago. I will not necessarily remember um, exactly um, what I said or the forgiveness statements that I did on real time moments, which is okay. But when I have it on on the screen, it's there is there is a realness to it. I can revisit it. I can see sometimes that I missed something, that there is still some unresolved deeper dimensions, and. I can continue to walk it deeper. And we as humans, we are so vague. We are like clouds on the sky. We shape and reshape and change our forms all the time. And having like a chronic of it, do you say chronic? No, <laughs> an archive. This is a German wa word, an chronic. <laughs> yes, but it's chronicle, you know, in the sense of that um, you have a database. You know, our minds is, is so weak, we forget. We forget. And having it on the screen, on paper, on the screen, <laughs> this is, you know, having that moment of actual realness um, and substance. And yeah. So yeah, this was my process update. Um, for now, I wasn't vlogging for a long time. So yeah, there has to be more consistency in my in my walking, and. You know, without sharing and without putting it out for myself and for others, um, process being something invisible, it's when it's then only in me, in, in my mind. Is it still process as we know it, as we walk it? See you soon. <laughs>